Hello everyone, this is Dr. Kishore Alapati, Consultant Colorectal Surgeon at uh, Apollo Hospital Jubilee Hills. Today we'll briefly talk about uh, anal fistula, uh, the signs, symptoms associated with it, how to diagnose an anal fistula and also the treatment options that we have available. Anal fistula is basically an infection uh, or an abscess around the anal area which did not heal and eventually has converted itself into what we call a fistula tract. Coming to signs and symptoms, as I said, uh, usually an anal fistula is something that starts off as an abscess uh, or even like a small pimple in the perianal area. There will be external opening or a small sore uh, around the anal area through which uh, usually either some amount of pus or some amount of uh, liquid or sometimes blood tends to ooze out from this area. Uh, when you have something like this or you feel something like this, then uh, fistula is most likely the possibility you should think of. How do we diagnose an anal fistula? Basically, uh, you, uh, the patient needs to be examined by an expert like a colorectal surgeon. Uh, and usually on external examination, we tend to see the outside openings, which we call the external openings. After that is done, we usually tend to perform a rectal examination with our gloved finger. So after having established this, Usually we tend to do uh, two more most important tests. One is called an endoanal scan and the second one is called an MR fistulogram. Endoanal scan is a very important uh, examination which is basically an ultrasound that is performed around the anal area. Once after having done the ultrasound, we usually tend to identify the fistula tract and along with that we will be able to see if there is any abscess cavity associated with that. On the MR fistulogram, we will be able to delineate the entire fistula tract completely and we will also be able to know how much of the sphincter muscle is involved because based on this the treatment is determined depending on the complexity of the fistula tract. Different modalities of anal fistula treatment or the different surgical options that we have to treat an anal fistula range from a simple fistulectomy to a complex fistulectomy with the repair of the anal sphincter. All fistulas are definitely treatable and curable. The earlier we get a surgery done for a fistula, the better it is. So diet modifications is rather important. Taking care of the uh, perianal area, especially after motion passage is very important. Avoiding constipation is definitely one of the important factors. If you think uh, there is a possibility of a fistula or an anal abscess, uh, seeing an expert colorectal surgeon and having it taken care of appropriately would definitely prevent a possibility of a future recurrence. Thank you.